Hola mis amores, this is Kirby Marie here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome back to some more Soma. Before we begin, I would appreciate if you guys would subscribe to the channel and ring the bell to get notified about the latest videos. Also, why not drop me that like button? It helps out a lot. Also, leave your comments, your thoughts on this video. So last episode where we left off, we were outside of Omicron. We were trying to get away, trying to get in somehow. Then in the end, we actually did manage to get in whatsoever. And, um, and then we found a lot of decapitated bodies whatsoever. Um, I have a feeling that we're not alone in this place. There's something more than what I can tell in this place. I don't know what it is yet. But, um, we're also supposed to look for some stuff in like Catherine sent on this scavenger hunt. Um, we're looking for a cortex chip, a structure gel, and a battery pack. So yeah, that's gonna take us a while, so yeah. Without further ado, let's just jump right in. We're just gonna record everything until we find the items. I don't know if I can... Start with this one here. Okay, lock it up. <laughs> okay. Let me in. Let me in. There better not be something following me. I know there's something in that room up there. Simon keeps pushing in there. Oh! Wait, so it starts here. Simon must have been glitching, he's panicking. I don't see anything in this. Well, I do see the decapitated head, but I can't reach or anything. Connectivity. Lisa Cameron. The structure gel has been charged and actually keeps going for a while. Even when removed from a power so source, if applied to circus, it seems to help out with the connectivity. Function, Lisa Cameron. It seems like it's not only connectivity, but... What was that? I didn't see what was it. The gel can make simple machinery work and act more efficiently. However, the modifications that the WoW has made to the gel are full extremation that doesn't necessarily make sense. When applied to something more complicated, it causes the gel to act as a cancer upon the host, eventually ruinate it. We could use the gel to our advantage, but it needs to be uncalibrated to get rid of the bad code. Pathology. Jacob Halperin. So it just the monster saying we have to stop it. Stop what? Apply gel to dead mouse. The gel caused the mouse to appear alive. It was put into the same habitat as living mouse. The reanimated mouse was apathetic while the living one seemed stressed. After 15 minutes, the reanimated mouse attacked and killed the living mouse. Half an hour later, the reanimated mouse stopped moving. The corpse was solid as the gel had hardened the thing. Jacob Halperin reanimated another mouse with structure gel this time. I'm gonna see it. This time it was done with uncalibrated gel as produced by Ames. The result was impressive. The thing appears catatonic, but it's more of a sleepwalker. To avoid the thing hardening as before, electromagnets are used to cause a low electrical current within the animal. This has also provided us the ability to somewhat control it. Paula Lansky. The structured gel remains unchanged for a fundamental level. It's still the same crossing gel with aligned graphene in a polyunsaturated matrix that was installed through the pathos a few years ago. The problem is not the gel, but it's the controller. The WoW, the gel has not taken on any new properties. The WoW was the WoW simply uses it in ways that we would never have ever dreamed of. Study results, Claudia Eames. Overwhelming evidence concludes that all deformed creatures, the fish, the sharks, and even the helpers were manipulated by the wild. Yes, structure gel. They have some men have been exposed to charged gel and it turned into struck him by a cancerous group that affects their whole being. It's difficult to ask why they were talking about an AI, but it all started shortly after the asteroid killed the surface. I can't say for sure what if it's bad code or carefully programmed mercy killing, but it looks like it's not going any. It's not going to make things easier for us to survive. Well, I see something shining. 
Yes! Oh, what's this? Hmm. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. 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 Let's uh, I gotta push it back. Keep it going. Um. By the way, if you're wondering, I did a little bit of this, but good thing that I found my freaking voice. Yeah, I'm doing it again. Um, stop. Dispense the gel. I want to see up close how does it work. Ooh. There we go. Done. Give it back to me. Let's put it back the way it was. Not there, dummy. Um, there we go. Okay. Open. Get out. We got the job. Ladies and gentlemen, we got the job. Now let's use it on our hair. Oh, this is not for hair? No. Wait, I already passed it on my hair. Oh, my hair is gonna get infected and turn into a zombie. Disgusting! <laughs> Yeah. Right. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Stay all away from me. Hello? There's a new door unlocked. Let's don't do that. Let's go up. Mm -hmm. uh, we're upper. We need you to override. Okay. Let's start here. There's so many places you can go from here. Yeah, remember this. A little bit. Energy PAL S3 high performance rechargeable lithium sulfur packs. Standard S3 connection high muxies energy power from machine tools, XL rigs, and power suits when the cluttered recharge pack in the high muxie charge and five or the other S3 compatible charger. Hold on a second. Alright, we need to s actually sneak past her. I hope. Please don't see me, please don't see me. Oh my god, oh my god. No, no, no. no. Gotta get the hell out of here. Oh my god, did she actually just saw me? There's no one in here, bruh. Um Hide, 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 just in case. She saw me again. Yeah. He actually did. Damn it. How could she see me again? Stop it right now. Okay. 
satu kita Sudah dengan sini Get the hell out of here Man, you can't disturb this woman. No. Hell out of here. I don't want to stand anywhere. Oh my god, exploded head. What is this? Johan Ross was found dead on climb this morning. Johan Ross. Anthony Howell. A couple of days ago, but I see no reason to suspect them playing part in his death. The climb could have gotten any worse, by the way. The whole schedule is the climber returned with only a lifeless body of Alpha member Johan Ross. No traces of the ARC team. Cameron Eames Lansky. All studying the body inside containment. I'll follow up with whatever they find. Linda S. Okay. Second one. The world has been getting more aggressive, pushing all systems to their limits. Ironically, the dead Dr. Johan Ross would be the perfect person to ask why the WOW is making such a big buzz about his passing. After all, the WOW isn't supposed to want anything, and definitely not to mourn people. Mm. The system overload affects the staff considerably. Headaches, loss of sleep, unwarranted stress. And it seems to be getting worse. I could use some advice if you can get through. Delenda Est. Things are out of hand. The staff looks like they're about to explode. Yikes. Every other person walks around with nosebleeds, and the rest keep wiping stains of blood from their eyes to keep them from overflowing. Yikes. Yikes. It's to do with the WOW trying to free Ross somehow, for sure. At this point, I wouldn't be surprised if the body just got up and left. <laughs> Rally Herber, our dispatcher, has been snooping around asking questions she shouldn't. Rally. She says she's going down into the abyss to find Alpha. Myself to stop her. Oh my god. So her head exploded. Yeah. By the way, there's a thing in here. Let's punch it and let it suck her head. <laughs> Sometimes I'm scared to do that as well because it could free other stuff, but. Alright, we are done with this section for Gucci's. Open this, but I think I'm not. Oh my Ooh. god! Ugh, way too many dead corpses that we can't check. Well, I'm going back down. I, I don't want to stay here any longer. No! Oh my god! Oh my god! Where is it? Where's the body? What the hell are you? I think it's... Yep. The first floor. Oh my god. I don't rem remember this body being here. Something is here with us. Yeah. Are you trying to reach your sneakers? I need to read you. You're headless. Okay. Lower. Override. I think we, we are also miss. We got the battery pack and gel. We're only missing the quick chip. Mm. Dead body in there, but I'll be there in a moment. Did a little bit of this puzzle, I think. Okay. 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 
And then there's still the matter of this guy. Which you can't talk to him, but okay. Hmm. Much lines and stuff. Structure jaw one. And more recordings of the data. Are you there? Can I hear you, Herbie? What's up? Uh just wanted to check in. It sounded like Kirby, it's, it's Herbie. I might not be around for a few days, okay? Rally her relieving the listening post? Must be important. It is, Strask. It is. Well, okay then. Stay safe. Okay then. Omicron, can you hear us? Loud and clear. Everyone alright? We will be as soon as we make friends with the power suits. I'm sure you'll get used to it. Respond. This is Rally Herber calling from Omicron. Please respond, Tau. Unable to connect. Lumar relay out of range. Damn. Yeah, yeah, I guess. Unable to connect. Stop why? What's Unable it? to connect. Lumar relay out of range. I have a bad feeling this guy's gonna cheese our ass down. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. Uh. I'm panicking, I'm panicking, get me out of this place. <sighs> ah! Get me out, oh, run, run like you, like you have diarrhea or something. Oh my god! Shut it, shut it, oh my god. Lock the door. It worked! Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, let's big time. Piss off another one of WoW's monsters. We have everything we need, right? Yes. Yeah. Let's get to work. Okay, by the way, what do I do? We need to assemble your new body with the things you collected. Just stuff all of it into the suit of the dead body. Oh my god. Okay then. Oh, oh disgusting. This is crazy. <laughs> Don't worry, it'll work. I know, it's nasty. Just make sure it's all bunched together with the structure gel connecting all the parts. Oh my god. Alright, try activating the seat from the terminal again. By the way, this is her oh, now that I know it's Herbert. Really? Yeah, really. Okay, let's retry it. I can't believe we're doing this. It will be fine. Then why don't we put you in the suit? Simon. I would just that if you refused. You'd go without me. I need to do this, Simon. This is important. I need to launch the Ark. You'd really do it, change body. Yes. If you want to stay here, I'm not going to stand in your way. I don't want to tell you what to do. What would be like before? Close my eyes and then... And then open them again. All right, let's do it. Thank you, Simon. Go sit in the pilot seat in the next room. You might need to boot it up. Okay, give me a moment then, girl. All right, camera back on. Um. We need to loop back the activity manifested by your current Cortex chip, run it through the amplifier, feed it into the new chip. That's everything. You can climb into the pilot seat now. Okay. Already? I have everything under control, so please. Have a seat. Wish me luck, girl. Sorry about any discomfort. This should be over soon. Just like having a picture taken. Oh my god, just like Dr. Munchie said. You know, Indians thought photos would steal their souls. In this case, they'd be right. Just hurry up. I don't want to be in this place any longer than I already have to. Well, we transported b bodies. Or something? Wait a second. Oh my that? god. I no, just... I, I just... Why was it still talking? It's the same like before. Catherine, why was he still talking? That's how it works, you know that. What do you mean? You know it's not magic. 
magic. You were copied. The sleeping Simon in the sea was copied, and now you are here, just like Simon lived on in Toronto. What? God, what? You cast two Simons? There can't be two Simons. What did you think would happen? That you were going to take my mind and put it into another body, like a brain transplant. Yeah, that's what we thought. I'm sorry, it wouldn't work that way. You realize how messed up this is? Please, I didn't mean to upset. How did you expect me to react to this? Please stop. You're disgusting. Well, Simon, you're taking it too far as well. What's gonna happen to him? He'll sleep for a while, a few days. And then what? Wake up in this nightmare again? All alone? Oh, so cruel. Well, what do you want me to do with him? Make friends? Let him know that we have to leave him behind when we go into the abyss? What if... What if he didn't need to wake up? Oh, Did my God. Do that? Oh. Well, it is himself, Maybe. so... If you want to drain his battery, he'll die within a minute. I'd rather not stay plugged in any longer. Simon. I hate you. And I, well. Anyway, so this was me before. Damn. Just to not make you suffer any longer. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Anyways. Alright. Let's swipe the arm and tunnel. Let's just get out of here. This is going to go right back to the underwater. Takes forever to open. There we go. And with this suit, I can actually run faster. I don't. I mean, I think I could run faster before. But now oh, there's something down there, so no way. No. Yes, this one has one. No, I don't know what we're gonna do. Let's go down. Okay. Let's put Catherine in there. Are we done here? Yeah. No Activate moment. the Clara, please. Yeah, she's sure his piss. Mm. Okay. Catherine is pissed, Simon. He just had to mess we it up. What happens when we die here? Is that even possible? If there's some kind of afterlife. Do you think my place is taken? He died like a hundred years ago. Is there still room for me? And what about the Simon I killed at Omicron? What do you think, Catherine? Is there a heaven full of redundant copies of the same people? Is there someone up there who call me an imposter? <laughs> Among us. <laughs> it's dumb luck, right? I woke up in the right body. They basically flipped a coin, and if I had called the wrong side, I'd be rotting away at Omicron. I mean, there's nowhere to know, right? She's pissing sure you. Wakes up in the right I mean, body, if you, you call a woman disgusting, not that you would know. if you call me disgusting, I would right never sign. speak to you again. Christ. In fact, this is awful. We did an awful thing. And you wouldn't mind? Why would you? How could you know that it's not me, the me that I am, the same that I've always been? I don't know, dude. Please say something. I don't want to think. Please. I don't know what to say. I don't want to upset you. 
Poor Cadre. Say anything. When I was little, I used to climb the stairs all the way to the top of the building. And I can still feel how I had to, you know, tuck my arm so I could push the heavy steel door open. Well, the first time that I dared go up there, I stepped out onto the roof and watched the smog rise and fall over Taipei. I got all the way up to the corner ledge and, you know, I felt the warm wind in my hair and the sun was setting and the streets below were shadowed by the tall buildings. The people pushing through the crowd flowed like paint from an artist's brush. Street food vendors filled the air with aromas of all my favorite foods. For a brief moment, I felt connected to the world in a way that I never had before. It was the most profound feeling of comfort and sense of belonging I could ever hope for. I really never felt the same way again, but I went up to the roof many times after. I'm not religious, but I can see why people would be. The privilege of being makes a strong case, at least every once in a while. Yeah. You still feel that sense of awe? Even like this? Things are different, but we're still here. What's the point of going on? Everyone's gone. All the people still left are digital copies trapped in computers at the bottom of the sea. We'll never be able to rebuild or reclaim what we were. Are you really so unhappy being what you are, or is this about the man who went for a scan a hundred years ago? Both, I guess. When I was back in Toronto, even the worst case, the darkest futures I could predict, they at least included my previous life somehow. I feel so uprooted. There's nothing here that I recognize, nothing that makes me feel like I belong. Even if we make it to the Ark, would it be any different? I'd still be alone. No friends. No family. You could make new friends. I'm sure everyone would like to know the time traveler. If not, you still have... What was that? Yeah? Get me out of this chair. Get me out of this chair. Hello? Yeah? Yeah? Oh my god. Hello, Catherine. What happened? Damn it. Hold on. All right, let's find out what's going on. Goodness. I gotta go to the other side. It's like, let's be careful. This looks like we could fall and die. Yeah. Who pushed this? Now I push it back. I know it's not much, but why have we stopped moving? The power blacked out for a moment. I think it could be the atmospheric pressure. It's pushing pretty hard, really testing the limits of my suit. Don't worry, it should hold. Comforting. It will hold. Listen to Kadra, she's been nothing this, but nice to us this whole does time. Does time freeze when you're not powered? Time feels a minute. What's the difference? I don't feel like I'm being held back or hindered. And I don't have the opportunity to reflect on the time I'm missing. It's simply missing. Sounds like sleeping without the dreaming. Yes, but generally you anticipate when you're about to sleep, and there's a natural continuation since we tend to wake up where we went to sleep. Yeah, My look at the screen. It's already breaking like a little bit. An ever-changing moment that never really I seems I saw to breaking find pleasure. Better. Sounds kind of like a movie being edited See? live. I suppose so. I guess it sounds exciting, but it really keeps me activated to the point of exhaustion. <sighs> Rough. Could be worse. Damn cat. Could be a time traveler stuck in a body made from black goo. <laughs> That'd be the worst. Oh my god. Huh? Hello? What? What's going on? <gasps> You're so ugly! You did it! You did it! <laughs> By the way, and Ro Johan Ross! I immediately recognized the Anthony Howell voice. Oh my god. Did he kidnap me right now? I refresh my mind, I don't know. Oh, he didn't do anything? What the hell? Oh, good, you're back. Cat! What happened? Something dropped onto the cage. Knocks you right out. You saw it? It spoke to me. Looks like a man. One of WoW's creatures. It just stared at you for a moment, then threw itself down the abyss. 
it said it would make preparations. I don't like the sound of that. No. Me neither. Very strange. I thought it was going to kill you for sure. I'm glad it didn't. Yeah. Me too. <sighs> Looks like we're closing in on the ocean floor. Good. Not sure the climber can take it much longer. Okay, so this is the Omega Sector. It's about an acre of the Abyssal Plan used by Pathos 2. Okay. I expect we'll have to do some walking before we reach town. Oh my yeah. god. Okay, so we are Nothing doing stuff and then we reach town. We're following in your old footsteps, Kat. When I had footsteps. <laughs> you could still be down here somewhere, <laughs> technically. Don't remind me. <laughs> Alright, let's head for town and find that arc. Okay. Anyways, as much as I would like to continue this episode, I am going to end it here. It's been a couple of minutes, but yeah, things have been crazy. And I can't believe it, we finally met Johan Ross. I recognize the Anthony Howell voice, like, perfect. He did a great job once again. Very excited to hear his voice again in a video game, even though this was not like new or anything. But it's cool. Um... Everything was scary, and that female creature, like, I try to sneak past her twice, and then she just apparently see me. And the funniest thing is that she never followed me back again, it was like that. <laughs> um, if you guys enjoyed this video, why not drop me the like button? Also, why not subscribe to the channel, ring the bell to get notified about the latest videos, and also leave your comments and your thoughts on this video, and anything else in general, and that'll be it. I love you all, I appreciate you, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!